This is our countdown of the top 10 most anticipated PC open world games. There's so many different open world games to pick from on PC, the lineup is stacked and without further ado, let's get right into this with number 10. Number 10, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Ubisoft has been putting out a lot of open world games this generation, from The Division to Watch Dogs, here's another, Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. This is one of Ubisoft's biggest open world games ever, featuring a variety of different environments such as mountains, forests, deserts, etc. The game itself is a cooperative tactical shooter where you explore this massive open world complete missions for the player to decide how to tackle. Now while Wildlands does have an emphasis on its cooperative gameplay, it can be played solo although then you'll be accompanied by three AI bots. Probably would be the best idea to play the game with some friends, Ubisoft definitely isn't the most respected publisher in the PC gaming world, hopefully they deliver with this one. Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands releases March 7th, 2017. Number 9, Crackdown 3. Crackdown is a series that's foreign to PC gamers, it's always been exclusive to the Xbox, that is until Crackdown 3. Crackdown is an open world third person shooter that really puts the power into the player's hands. It makes you feel like a superhero, running from rooftop to rooftop at high speed, shooting everything down, at the very least Crackdown gets pure fun right. Crackdown 3 will also feature mass scale destruction thanks to Microsoft Azure which will allow everything in the game's world to be destructible. The game releases in 2017. Destruction and mayhem. It's not just what you can do with a gun. It's the opportunities you Number 8, Of Kings and Men. Of Kings and Men is an open world medieval multiplayer game set in the 13th century. You play in a world filled with conflict and the combat ranges from simplistic 1v1 duels to large scale 200 player wars. As medieval becomes more and more of an emerging genre in gaming, Of Kings and Men looks to be one with a lot of potential. We still don't have an exact release date for the game as of this point, but hopefully sometime late 2016 or early 2017. Number 7, Kingdom Come Deliverance. Kingdom Come Deliverance is a game that I would think much more people would be excited for than what is the case right now. The game is an open world RPG set in the 15th century medieval kingdom of Bohemia. It has a focus on both historically accurate and realistic content. The game follows the son of a blacksmith whose family was killed by an invading army, he seeks revenge, and his ultimate goal is to restore order to his land. Kingdom Come Deliverance is running on the Pry Engine, so expect the visuals to be pretty good. There will also be a lot of variety to the game, allowing you to take your character whichever way you want. You can take on the role of a warrior or thief or something in between. The game looks to have a lot of content, it releases sometime in 2017. Number 6, Forza Horizon 3. Forza is another series that PC gamers aren't all too accustomed to, but Forza Horizon 3 will be coming to PC. Forza Horizon is different from Forza Motorsport in that it's more of an arcadey open world racer. Now when I say arcadey, it isn't that it abandons all realism, it just caters a bit more to casuals. Forza Horizon 3 will take place in an open world environment based on Australia, and for those of you that did play Forza Horizon 2, the map will be twice the size in this game compared to the last, that means it's gonna be gigantic. Forza Horizon 3 releases on September 27, 2016. The race is on. Number 5, Mafia 3. Mafia 3 seems to be one of the more anticipated games of this year. It's the first Mafia game in 6 years. Mafia 2 was a very good game, although it was very linear. That obviously won't be the case in Mafia 3 as the game is shifting into a large open world New Orleans. The goal of the game is for the main character Lincoln Clay to build up his own mafia, take over the city, and eventually take revenge on the Italian mob, which killed many close to Lincoln. From a visual and production standpoint, Mafia 3 seems to be at a very high level. The game releases on October 7th. Number 4, Scalebound. We've talked about Xbox games coming to PC quite a few times in this video, but none may be as exciting as Scalebound, an action RPG being developed by Platinum Games which was once an Xbox One exclusive. The major issue with Scalebound based on the footage we've seen in the past was on the performance end, and if it's a good port on PC, which is a big if, that should be completely rectified. And to play a game like this in 1080p or higher and 60fps seems pretty enticing. From a gameplay and visual standpoint, it looks really good. Scalebound releases sometime in 2017. Uh. 
Number 3, Star Citizen. Whenever you talk about upcoming PC games, it seems like one you have to talk about is Star Citizen. It's such an ambitious game, maybe a little too ambitious for its own good. If somehow you don't know what the game is, Star Citizen is a multitude of experiences. It's a space sim, a first person shooter, an exploration game, and more, all in a persistent MMO universe. The game was crowdfunded with over $110 million, which is absolute insanity for a video game. The game will also feature a highly robust single player experience, dubbed Squadron 42, featuring the likes of Mark Hamill. Hopefully Star Citizen is available to everyone sooner rather than later. Number 2, No Man's Sky. No Man's Sky has been one of the most anticipated games for the last few years. It's easy to see why. Open world games have become immensely popular, and No Man's Sky is taking that formula and amplifying it by becoming an open universe game. The game pits you as a planetary explorer that starts on a planet at the edge of the galaxy. You find items and materials to upgrade your ship and make your way through the galaxy and its planets. How many planets? Somewhere in the ballpark of 18 quintillion. However, the game isn't just mindless exploration. The goal of the game is to get to the center of the galaxy where you'll find the most exotic planets with the best materials. No Man's Sky is such an ambitious game being developed by a very small studio at Hello Games. The release is right around the corner. It comes August 9th. Number 1, Escape from Tarkov. Escape from Tarkov is a pretty insane game. It's a first-person open-world RPG in an MMO setting. It's also expected to be very story-driven, which isn't typical for a game like this. The game pits you in the city of Tarkov, which has been torn apart by war. You have to cooperate with other players to discover the secrets behind the city and eventually find a way out. You'll have to fight against hostile enemies, make sure you're healthy at all times because when you die, you lose everything you found in a raid. Escape from Tarkov has a ton of potential. Hopefully it delivers. We still don't have an exact release date, but 2017 makes sense. So that wraps up our countdown of the top 10 most anticipated PC open world games. What do you think? Which games are you the most excited for? Comment your thoughts down below. Thank you for watching and goodbye.